so much better. Now let's see which are up for show and which are actually strummable. Keep playing. All right. Carrie? Carrie? No. <laughs> no. no That's some fucking joke. Hang on. What did Silverhand tell me before he died? This a test? Could just play you another song. Answer me. Told you to leave Samurai. Go your own way. Clearly I was right, as I often am. Johnny fucking Silverhand. Fuck. I mean, how? Surprise. Motherfucker! Okay, weren't expecting me. I get it. Oh, fucking contraire. Been waiting 50 years to do that. So you changed a bit. Nice rack. Sporting a new style? Yeah, kinda. What about you? Shit. Johnny. Oh, man. I need a drink. All right. Come on. Tell me, why do you look like a small-time kleptopunk from the afterlife? Wait up! Been in Night City long? No, no long. City is new. Wind from west carry me far, far to here. Like petal, a sakura blossom. Yeah, not in the mood for the shtick. That ain't how the Japanese talk. <laughs> You'd be surprised. Should have heard my dead grandma talk. I swear to God, that woman only ever spoke in haiku. Hey, got anything new in stock? Tourists already bought out my stock of Tabi. But should have something you'll like. Ready to trash? I don't know. Maybe this isn't such a good idea. Now you mention it? It's getting worse. Maybe this gig isn't worth it? Fine, go out and play. I'll just sit back, tend to my bleeding ears. <laughs> okay, fine. You got me. Have fun. I see what you're doing here, but I still plan on playing. You want to hear a new... Johnny! Ugh. 
He's gone, isn't he? Yeah. Yeah, but he can still hear you. Thanks, but not in the mood for hovering tables and voices from beyond the grave right now. Maybe you should hang on to this, actually. That was the gig. Helloprim. <laughs> Samurai's found its new growth. Damn shame I had to miss it. Eh, can still come to my show. No, you shouldn't have. Really. The very gun I tried to shoot Johnny with when he broke into my house. Meaning you tried to shoot me. Yeah. And earlier... And... never mind. Cool. Feel like I fell asleep and woke up 50 years later. Back to work, then. Take care, V. I'll be in touch. V, how you feel? Can't believe that asshole Carrie just up and left you like this. Guess he had somewhere to be. Badly. Probably writing a new song as we speak. Isn't that what you wanted? To make him feel better? Better, but not that good. Johnny, don't ever leave me again. I can't live without you. A little of that could go a long way. it for last requests not sure i can handle anymore it is and i'm starting to regret you agreed to this concert thing <sighs> here i thought i'd hear thank you v said it was important to you this thing with carrie it was but not more important than you carrie's got his life back whereas we should be worrying about how to get yours back let's go Wait, what the hell is this? What it looks like. Swedenborg Riviera. Ha! Come one, come all for the profit of Night City. Ha! Oh, that's too good. A wind-up philosopher in a box. Hand me a couple of eddies. See what he cranks out next. How? How is this even possible? Not a fucking clue. But Jesus, V, how beautiful is this? Half the net's getting tweaked on wisdom from a puppet in a glass case. Hairs are being split. Spit is flying over interpretations. Oh, man. Let me tell you. Fifty years of soul prison was worth it for this moment right here. You shall meet an attractive lobbyist when you least expect a violent outbreak of class warfare. Success is the delusion of the soul. Uh, need to take a look. Somebody must have tampered with this thing. <laughs> Seriously? What, you think you're gonna find a jack-in-a-box who wants to become a real boy? <laughs> look, someone hooked Swedenborg up to the net. What are you waiting for? Let's see what secrets are flowing in those cables. <laughs> Ah! 
Spence would suit you a lot better if you lost a bit of weight. That's where you wrong, girl. The more sweet body you got, the more threads you can put on it. Like your style. Think I'll buy something. What do you mean, think? Sweetheart, don't think. Just put something on and shine. If I wasn't always on the move, you and I could spend more time together. Enjoy life. Quality over quantity, V. Just focus on tying up all your loose ends. Then you and I are leaving this city once and for all. Still think about leaving Night City? Yeah, someday. But as of right now, I've still got a reason to stay. <sighs> Try to. Helps to keep it at the back of my mind. Guarantee it does. People already say I've got a bounce in my step. Let's talk for a little while longer. Before I have to Delta somewhere. For you, I've got all day. Selling threads or collecting them? Hard to tell at a glance. Back on the street, they tell you to get a job, you get a job, they make fun of you. Make up your damn minds, people! So, what good'll my balls do us today? V. Some people in this town, they've gone completely whacked. You, you're gonna help me set things right in this shithole we call home. Uh-huh. How's that exactly? Yeah, there's this little girl group. Us cracks, right? Three birds from Japan, laser pop scop. Yeah, big over in Asia. I mean, pff, who isn't? Now they signed some deal for an NUS tour. Want to promote it with a cover of my song. Can you believe that? Not about to let them play me like that. There she is. Right on the dot. Shut up. I take the driver. You get his side shoe. We want him out of the truck. You sure two, what? what you're doing. The hell was that? Out of the truck, on the ground, hands where I can see him. Get out. Nice and easy, no weirdness, nothing will happen. Got the wrong truck. Fuck, we're not. I said, easy. Now get down on the ground. Won't say it a third time. Hey, man, lose the iron. Let's talk it out. Not a word. It'll all be over soon. Oh, fucking hell. Access guard! Grab it! Pop the back. Quit squirming. And no gonk moves. What's inside? 
stuff's ah, worth at least a couple nice hundred and down. Still there, boys. Really want to trash it, not clep it? Please. Never stolen a thing in my life. Fuck me, he really believes that? I remember all my strings getting swiped back in the day. Never had his own. Right, gents. Now, run along and don't look back. I said, Delta the fuck off. Now for the grand finale. Want this set to be a smoldering puddle of chrome and plastic when we're done. Hey, Gary. You know what I'm looking at? Us Cracks concert announcement. This is not fucking happening. Wait, what? I thought we took care of it. Truck didn't do shit. They just postponed the game. Look, meet me outside the club. Little push didn't work. Now we gotta shove. Dread talking to the label, didn't you? What do you think I did first? I sent my manager after him. Yeah, hell of a lot that did. Sent me back a crate of fine whiskey and started bombarding me with PR shit every two seconds reminding me about our deal. Fuck. What now? Gonna plant a bomb in the club? Nah. Gonna talk. Okay, good, because I thought... Bring your heat. What kind of wines do you have? By the looks of you, I doubt their names would tell you anything. Throat's feeling parched. What have you got? We cater to the cream of the corporate elite. I believe our wines would be slightly beyond your price range. Maybe I didn't drink Champeridy every day, but Chateau Piquet was all the rage back in Arasaka. Please, forgive me, a misunderstanding, that's all. Mr. Would you like to see the wine list? Night, every night. Don't be soft. How long have you been running this place? As long as I can remember. Granddad opened the original merchants back in Cambridge, and then Father brought it here, to Night City. We have a today, me goody. Oh, wait. This is a special boy from Foundation Organization? Now, we're gonna chat. Who the fuck are you? The fucking guy you robbed! Carrie Uridine! Carrie son! I ain't your son. This ain't a meet and greet either. V? You will do what he says, now! And then you'll forget he was ever here. And if we don't? Don't? And you could say goodbye to your careers right now. Simple as that. Carrie son, we don't get it. We have a deal. They said you loved us. They said your bedroom was full of- Oh, hell no. You hearing this? The fuck are you on? I'd sure like to try it. Wait, wait, wait. What's this about a deal? We signed a deal with MSM to play Carrie son's user friendly. It's like our new single for the North American leg of the tour. Over. My. Dead. Body. But we're going to bring your rock into a new era. Isn't that what you want? Rock? You? Okay, let me tell you something. It's been claimed before, but you actually did it. Rock is dead, and you killed it? Congratulations! Your manager contacted ours. Said you wanted to work with us. Kovacek? The, the fuck? He, he never even asked me. The fucking corpo cunt bag. Listen, Carrie san that cover is an expression of our love for you. Please, let's work something out. Rock might be dead, but Carrie's blind if he can't see these girls got potential. Looks like the label fucked you all. You're their pawns. They're playing you. Looks that way. Fuck. You know. Got nothing against you. The sitch. That's what's fucked. Well, you chained your gonk ass to the corpos. What'd you expect? We'll talk to the label, Carrie son. But right now, we'll make our displeasure known. Your song's not in the set. We're calling off the concert and suspending the tour. Seriously? You'll lose millions. They'll lose even more. Well. Okay. 
You girls... Uh, you're all right. What I said earlier, I... No biggie, Carrie son Even monkeys fall from trees. Right. Let's go, V. Wait! Carrie san can we get a pic with you? Just... as a souvenir? Um... Pff, why the hell not? V, do the honors? Hang on, let's get a selfie. All right, think we got it. Thanks, Terry san Um, so, you working on any new songs? We could maybe pick one for your single. <gasps> really? Yeah, gonna stick around some, V. I mean, look at them. The girls need help. Thanks. Hmm. Have fun. Terry san maybe you'd like. Want to hear about our new single? About? Come on, talking about music's like fucking in a bed of azaleas. Unnecessary, uncomfortable, and ultimately, kits is all fucking get out. Huh. I kind of like azaleas. So, maybe you'd listen to some tracks in progress? We're working on loads. Uh, no. Rather, we didn't get ahead of ourselves. Not that chummy just yet. Then, like, at least give this one a chance. Just sent it your way. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. It's not complete, tripe. Like the title enough, she's kind of catchy. Indirectly metaphorical. Say that goes to show you, you shouldn't trust a word that comes out of my mouth. Sweet little lies. Only way I can get at the truth. Now, girls, how was it to work with the legendary Carrie Uridine? Carrie Song is the most sweet, most lovely man in the world. We met Carrie Song when he came to the dressing room. Love at first sight. She is wonderful. So sensitive and so, so naughty. Our Carrie bad boy. Carrie, over here! Here! Thank you. You're breathtaking, Thank you. Carrie! 
You're breathtaking. This is V, my, uh, right hand. V's the little bird that shows up when I gotta wrap up and run. Sorry. V, V, quick question. What's it like hanging with Carrie Uridine, a living legend? It's a wild and crazy ride. V. But, hey, can't complain. Thanks, but I really gotta run. Late for my next thing already. Unless you feel like giving a few more interviews. You look great. Oh, you do too. V should be in our next video. Or be personal bodyguard. <laughs> a little busy at the moment, but I'll call you if I'm hard up. Hey, come with me. I want you to meet someone. V. Spectre. His old friend. Met him walking in Memphis. Off Beale. Ages ago. Hey. He's got preem stuff. Give your friends and family discounts, too. Of course, Mr. Uridine. Special rate for your friends. Be back later. We'll talk biz. Sure thing. Come with me. I want to show you something. Congrats, Care. Decent show. Now that that's behind us, what's Carrie Uridine's next mission? Hit on Kovacek? Very funny. But yeah, not about to let him get away with it. Maybe not today, maybe not tomorrow. But the bastard's gonna regret making me sign those papers. You try to get out of that deal with the label? Ah, let's be real. Say I break contract. Then what? Who's gonna release my new tracks? Who's gonna deal with distribution, promotion, influencers, media? Labels have got them all in their pockets. You're out with them, you're out, period. You'd be free. Seriously? Free to sing until you're blue in the face, nobody hearing a thing? It's just another kind of cage. Show you one of my favorite spots in Night City. Don't come here often, but when I do, it's important. Should I feel special? Don't let it go to your head. Told him to shut the place down for the day. <sighs> Can't get enough of this view. Love looking at this city from above. Well? Only place you fall asleep thinking you're special than wake up knowing you're no one. Sometimes wonder if I'll ever see anything more beautiful. I have. Doesn't matter, though. Night City's not something you ever forget. Just doesn't let you. I think I know what you mean. You ever feel like the city doesn't give you a choice? You either burn alive in it, or you never existed at all. Shit. Carrie, what's wrong? Tell me. Keep thinking about our conversation at Caliente. Us cracks, you and the slaves to the corpo grind? Mm hmm Guess I wasn't completely honest with you. Or myself, for that matter. Talk to me. See, thought I was afraid everybody think me another corpo slave. But I was just afraid I'd be in someone's shadow again. Again? Lived in Johnny's for years. Part of the scenery, machinery, helping him shine brighter. Never believed I'd make it on my own without Silverhand. That why he left Samurai. Fuck. But you did make it. Big, too. Only diehards remember Samurai now. You, everybody knows your name. You think that changes anything? Wake up with the same thought every damn day. That I might somehow fade into yeah, this town's steam, stench, murk, for good. Night City's a city of shadows. Done everything I could to walk clear of them for years. If 
back. I still got a lot to prove to this city, but you, you're at the top. City's yours. What's there to be afraid of? Yeah, we'll talk about this again someday. Once you're in my shoes. Think it's in the cards for me? You're strong. City couldn't swallow you if it tried. Should get back. Everyone downstairs is waiting. For you? I know, I know. In the knockback a few to this town tonight. And me in it. But I'm gonna stay up here a bit longer. You go ahead. Okay. See ya. <sighs> I'm gonna stay up here a sec longer. Carrie, can see something's eating you. Keep thinking about our conversation at Caliente. Us cracks, you and the slaves to the corpo grind? Mm -hmm. Guess I wasn't completely honest with you. Or myself, for that matter. Talk to me. See, thought I was afraid everybody think me another corpo slave. But I was just afraid I'd be in someone's shadow again. Again? Lived in Johnny's for years. Part of the scenery, machinery. Helping him shine brighter. Never believed I'd make it on my own without Silverhand. That why he left Samurai. Fuck. But you did make it. Big, too. Only diehards remember Samurai now. You? Everybody knows your name. You think that changes anything? Wake up with the same thought every damn day. That I might somehow fade into this town's steam, stench, murk. For good. Night City's a city of shadows. Done everything I could to walk clear of them for years. Time you stop being afraid. Don't need to be. Think it's that simple? I'll even protect you from yourself. Fuck. S sorry, V. I like you lots, but we this ain't going anywhere. Ah. Uh, <laughs> oh. Um, no worries. Sorry. Never mind. Thanks, though. For everything. <sighs> I'm gonna stay up here a sec longer. You go ahead, downstairs. Drink to this city, and to me in it. Okay. See ya. All right. Now for a breath of freedom. You gonna fucking help me? I just stand there like a gawk. Chaos and destruction? Why the fuck not? Grab something heavy. No regrets after? Owning a trashed yacht? My yacht? Honestly think I'd name my boat Seamurai. Fuck. Who's the fuck is it? Leadhead motherfucker L.B. Kovacek. Kovacek? That Kovacek? Mm-hmm. Never got a chance to properly thank him for the us crack shit and a few other things. Do something and smash it. This one's on LB. Okay, let's rip this boat to shreds. Well, well. Finally ready to party. Either he's gone senile or he's finally wising the fuck up. Could be either. Just 
No, thanks, V. I'm all right. Still got a little left in you? Remember when you woke up in that scrapyard? That's where he is now, being reborn with fuck all to stop him. It's time for the grand finale. Do the honors, V. Huh, baptism by fire and water. A fucking man. To settle in scores. Well fucking said. Suck on this, Kovacek. Race to the beach. Which gang's the city's biggest and baddest, according to the NCPD? How's the career switch? When's our new private detective starting up? Hmm, what now? Aiming to specialize in anything? Well, guess that makes sense. Take care. Talk soon, babe. Hey, V! It's Blue Moon from Us Cracks. You know, the band? Whole of Night City knows you. What's cracking? I've... got a problem. I... You mean you're not calling to ask me to be your backup dancer? I'm just... just kidding. What can I do you for? It's about a fan of mine. The, um, the weirder variety. I've been getting death threats. A lot of them. All sent to my private address. I'm also being followed. I can't just wait around until something bad happens. We have to find him and, and deal with him. I don't know how much you charge me, but I'm prepared to pay whatever the cost. Believe me. How do you know the threat's real, and not just a joke in poor taste? V! That last letter I got was a bomb. Security got to it first, of course, but... <sighs> you see what I'm dealing with? Uh-huh. Doesn't get more real than that. Our guy. You know anything about him? Nothing. Only that he signs his letters GC. Hmm. Not much to go on. Clue nonetheless. Can't your bandmates do anything about it? You seem like a bunch of girls who can take care of themselves. V, I don't even know what this guy looks like. We need to catch him in the act. Like, quietly. As for us, you said it yourself. The whole city knows our faces. Happy to help out. Carrie was right. You're like super chill. So, I've got a plan. I'll go for a little stroll by Kabuki Roundabout while you hang back. Watch out for any signs of trouble. You catch something suspicious, like you see the guy, and you're a hundred percent sure it's him. I'll know what to do. No, no, wait. We're not killing anyone here. That would be bad for the bands, like PR and stuff. All we want to do is teach him a lesson. Whatever. You make the rules. Awesome! So, just go to Kabuki, sit on the bench, and wait for me. I'll come to you. You're here. Awesome. 
So listen up. In a second, I'm gonna get up and walk a little, okay? When I call you, you'll start following me. But don't get too close, okay? We can't spook our guy. Keep your eyes peeled for anyone lurking around. Watching me, spying on me from above, whatever. Anything creepy like that. Got it. <sighs> okay, here it goes. Red Menace is keeping an extra lookout from a vantage point high up. Wish me luck. So you think I'm a kid, huh? I gave you everything! Everything! I don't even know who you are! V! V! Help! Shit. United in life! Boy Black shot her, yo! United in death! believe this you were supposed to protect her how could you let this happen how you dumb bitch i don't like your tone better watch it oh i'll watch as you choke i i'm sorry the, the the foot traffic i go before i do something i'll regret hey you all right? Get the fuck away from me! Go! Go fucking drown yourself! Thief! You weren't supposed to kill anyone, but... Uh... Maybe it's for the best. Agreed. Listen, I'll hang back and make sure nobody spills to the media vultures. Oh, and your fee, of course. I'll transfer it the second I get home. Promise. No rush. See you later, Blue Moon. And watch your back. Thunderstalker, stay where you are. Oh, okay. Be careful. Remember, no killing, please. Blue Moon, I've got her. Did you say her? Huh. Well, there's a twist. I'm heading there right now. you know it was her? She was acting weird. Turned out she was also packing iron and pictures of you. With your eyes cut out. Pretty solid evidence, wouldn't you say? Oh my god, V! Thank you, thank you so much! Don't mention it. It's what I was paid to do. A girl like that? Who'd have thought? What... What do we do now? This. Holy shit, V! What the fuck? Have you lost your mind? Me? No. But no question that she did. If we gave her up to the police, eventually she'd have walked free or escaped. And what do you think she'd do then? Who'd she go visit? Okay. You're right. I. Thank you for everything. I'll transfer your Eddie soon. Promise. Go get a stiff drink. Cool your nerves. Take care, Blue Moon. Now that that's over, you okay? I knew you'd come through. You're amazing. 
Wait till the badgers get here. But what about when they let her out? Or, or she escapes? Then you give me another call. Okay. You're right. I... Thank you. For everything. I'll transfer your Eddie soon. Promise. Go get a stiff drink. Cool your nerves. Take care, Blue Moon. God, I feel sick. Don't like this at all. This porcelain bitch is the worst kind of news. I know. I'll be careful. Not exactly one of your strong suits. Listen, first sign of trouble, be Delta. Excellent. You have come. Thanks for meeting me. Of course, V. And I thank you. Before we discuss details, I feel I owe you an explanation. I must tell you why I changed my mind and wish to help. You weren't sure of anything. If you could trust me, if your Nobud killed your father... No? I knew. From the start. You... knew? All the board members knew. Not one soul even slightly interested in the matter believed in the poisoning. Details were disparate, inconsistent. You knew, but didn't do a thing about it? Why? Suddenly sprout a conscience just yesterday? My father had flaws. I know this. I harbor no illusions about it. When a foe needed removal, my father ordered it without a thought to mercy. A way of being Yorinobu could not abide. But to my father, ends ever justified means. Saburo Arasaka has always valued just one thing. Do you know what it is? No idea. Family. Our family. I was to be its heart, to uphold life, ensure continuity, stability, never to oppose it. Huh? Guess Yorinobu's instructions were a little different? Yorinobu raised his hand against our father, but he is an Arasaka. He is family. I do not expect you to understand. I wish you merely to know I do not oppose my brother willingly that it is difficult. Mm hmm He's your brother. It's been hard, it'll be hard. Let's say I get that. But what changed your mind? We received a warning during the parade. Security protocols were violated. The first doubts sprouted then. They grew yet greater in your hideout when my brother's assault group arrived not to rescue, but to kill. Yorinobu was just plain willing to sacrifice you. My father was right about my brother. He never cared for us. I was brought up to be the heart of the family. It is time for the Arasakas to listen to their heart. It will bring justice. Did you bring Soul Killer? As we agreed, you Finger would. Finger on the trigger. Don't say a word. Seem on edge? Something got you spooked? I... don't know. Three times now that A.B. has flown by. Think someone might have tailed you? We must not get distracted. Did you bring Soul Killer? Take me for a fool? Think I'd fall for that? Got plans to walk out of here alive. Had I any ill intentions, I would have chosen a side far more discreet than this. 
We are here because I know how to save your life. I can lead you to Mikoshi. Venen, Mikoshi don't exist in real space. Yet its access points do, and one is very near. Where? Here in Night City, beneath Arasaka Tower. We ought to leave. Right now. Wanna leave? What gave you that idea? Quit button in so I can hear her out. This is gonna be a disaster. Sit. We have little time. And you'll help me in exchange for... My brother. You catch a whiff of that? Smells like shit. Careful not to step in it. He must be made to take responsibility for his deeds. Just say it. Be easier that way. I want him punished. Still vague. You want him dead. I want the Arasaka Corporation to know the truth. How you plan to do this? Yorinobu. Hanako-sama, soro-soro go jitaku ni omodori itadaite. Sugu ni sumu wa. Yorinobu will soon call a meeting of the board. Representatives of all factions are expected to attend. The perfect moment for them to learn the circumstances of my father's death. I will get you into this meeting, and you will testify against my brother. Testify? Listen, mind if I'm straight with you. Help me get rid of Yorinobu. I will help you get rid of the construct. Want me to throw Yorinobu under the bus in front of Arasaka Top Brass? Call me crazy, but that sounds like fucking suicide. This I know. And that is why we will take all the necessary precautions. Like... such as? You will see. Let's assume it works. Then what? You take the Arasaka throne? Where would you get that idea? Figured it as a given. Besides, Takamura said you were supposed to step in for Yorinobu here in Night City. Everyone must know their place, V. That is a fact my brother has never understood. I know my place, and I have no wish to change it. No wish to? Or no permission, you being a woman. I decide my own fate. As should you. So... Don't like this at all. Sounds like you want to use me. No. I simply offer you an opportunity. Not the first to try. But what if I am the last? You cannot take that chance. Let's fly the fuck out of here. V, do you feel all right? Huh? You are bleeding. Fuck. It seems you are running out of time. Don't delay. Make your decision. Ah, I'll think it over. from it now, V. That you can't stand on your own two feet. Well, I'm good to go. Body listens to me. See what I'm getting at? Yeah, I get it. And don't like it one bit. I'm still Come going on, strong. Come on, face the facts. Pop some pseudo-endotrizine. Scooch and let me get behind the wheel. I'll get us to fucking Mikoshi. Uh-huh. How exactly? Without that porcelain cunt's help, that's for damn sure. Don't stand a chance without help. Right about that. But that's why I'll bring Rogue. She's not rusted through just yet. 
plus she owes me. Maybe she stuck her neck out for you a half a century ago. But now, I don't see it. I'll convince her. After all, we know a thing or two about ops like this. We'll blast our way into Sokka Tower, just like we did back in the day. Then find the way inside Makoshi. It's our only chance. Do I even need you? Could ask Rogue myself. Won't take a risk this big with someone she still sees in Merc diapers. With me, it'd be just like old times. Hanako's offers on the table. I'm sorry. Whose? Oh, God, the crap. She actually has power. Could be our ticket. Our ticket, huh? Okay, I see your angle. You think working with the corpo cunt is gonna sweeten the deal? Well, let me tell you something. The corpo kleptocracy is not an option. Rogue and I will handle this, just like we used to. What about Pan Am? She offered help. Listen up, V. Those guys are trailer tuggers. An assault on our Asaka is just not another convoy to Jack. You already tried this with amateurs. Both know how that ended. And you... tried it with pros. Didn't end any fucking better. You don't want those people involved. Their lives on the line. Possibly on your conscience. Our one hope is sitting at the afterlife right now, and her name is Rogue. Rogue? I don't know. You honestly think it could work? With her experience, her resources, her connections... Won't find anyone better in NC. Johnny... It's gotta work. We breach the tower. All cracks open Makoshi. Then I fuck up that. Great. See what I'm getting at? I can see. Want me to hand over the keys? I want to save your life. Pop some pseudo endotrizine, scooch, and let me get behind the wheel. I'll get us to fucking Makoto. <laughs> Need more time. Need to. Don't you get it? Time is something we are fresh out of. Gotta stop you, dickhead. What's your scheme? This is my body. I make the. Not place. this time. <laughs> Johnny! Jesus, look at you. Can't even... Great, you checking out again?